Um, so I wrote a book about cloth diapering. Have you seen it? Do you have a copy yet? Cloth Diapers, The Ultimate Guide to Textiles, Washing and More is a beginner's guide to cloth diapering. It's available in black and white and color. I wrote and published it originally in 2020. I did an update in 2021 and I'm thinking about doing another update. This is a guide to help you problem solve. I am not one to give you the answer because I don't believe I have the answer. I don't believe I can make that choice for you. The best thing that I can do is give you your options, lay them out. Here is how it works. What do you think is going to work best for you? And so the biggest thing about my book is setting you up to make that choice and to make that decision and know where to go. So I tried my best to write it in super plain, simple English and provide you with as much information as you needed to really make a decision for your family. There is so much information in this book and a lot of people say they don't read it all, but they do go back and they reference it. I talk about budgeting. I talk about trusting in yourself, estimating costs, purchasing from China, buying used accessories, inserts. I include tons of photos of my kids in diapers, of product examples. And it's, it's just, it's step one. It's everything I know in a book because for some of us, we are tactile learners. Is it perfect? No. Am I mortified anytime anyone brings up that they've purchased it? Definitely. But what I wanted was to create a resource that works for other learning styles. I do not learn through video at all. Um, watching a YouTube video is probably one of the most painful things for me to do, but I learn through reading. And so with this book, I wanted to give you that opportunity to learn through reading, to leave this with a friend, to leave it somewhere to influence somebody's diapering experience. I'm always looking forward to new ways to update and share information and brands. And so I look forward to creating a new book or not creating a new book, updating it in 2022 and adapting the information as it needs because I'm always learning and you're always learning. And the information is changing as we learn together and we find simpler ways to do it. The one section right now in this book I consider really outdated is how to wash wool. Because what we've learned is we can really simplify that process. And the most important thing is to rinse out the water, rinse out the soap, like <laughs> rinse out the soap a lot. And through that learning process, this book will always need to be updated. And it's one thing that I think we should think critically about any resource on the internet. Yes, it was written in 2010, but what have we learned and what do we know today? What do we know can influence and change things? I mean, I am very cautious about bleach and vinegar in this book because that's kind of what I've been told, but I'm starting to learn maybe there is a better role for bleach and vinegar. So don't take this as the holy grail of cloth diapering. It's not gonna have every answer and it's not gonna be every answer for you but it's gonna help guide you to a place where maybe you can ask a better question and you can ask the right question to get the answer or the solutions that you need. So if you're looking to pick up a copy of it, it is available on Amazon in black and white. It's also available on Amazon and Barnes and Noble in color, or you can purchase it directly through me at the clothhyperpodcast.shop. If you purchase it through me, you'll get stickers, a coloring book, and I'll sign it. Isn't that awesome? Uh, you visit www.clothdiaperpodcast.com slash shop. And uh, thank you for considering cloth diapering. I'm so glad that I could have created this for you and helped parents around the world. If you need more help and more support, come find me on social media. I love connecting with parents on Instagram and TikTok and I'll see you online.